covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. According to a semi-annual ranking announced by the U.S. European Top 500 Project on Monday, Japan's latest supercomputer, Fugaku, is the world's fastest for computing speed. This is the first time that a Japanese supercomputer has taken the top position in nine years when the K computer, Fugaku's prede predecessor, took first place at this time in 2011. Jointly developed by Japan's state-backed Riken Center for Computational Science and Fujitsu, Fugaku is the first ever ARM-based system to become the world's fastest supercomputer. It scored a high-performance Linpack HPL score of 415.5 petaflops, which makes it 2.8 times faster than IBM Summit's 148.6 petaflops, that is now in second place in the top 500 supercomputer rankings. Fugaku is powered by Fujitsu's 48-core ARM-based A64FX system on chip and consists of nearly 7.3 million CPU cores. In single precision operations, it reaches peak performance of over 1,000 petaflops, which pushes our vernacular into the next tier at 1 exaflop. The chips run at 2.0 GHz with a boost to 2.2 GHz and carry 32 GB of second-generation high-bandwidth memory each. This ARM-based supercomputer also secured the number one position in other rankings that test computers on different parameters, including Graph 500, HPL, AI, and high-performance conjugate gradient. This is the first time that a supercomputer has simultaneously topped the rankings in the above four categories, according to Fujitsu. Currently installed at the Riken Center for Computational Science, in Kobe, Japan, Fugaku is, will also carry out a wide range of applications that will address high-priority social and scientific issues. While the supercomputer is expected to start full-time operation in April next year, they are already using it in the fight against COVID-19. In recent years, countries like the U.S. and China have dominated the race to develop powerful machines. This time, too, China dominated the top 500 list with 226 supercomputers, while the U.S. took second place with 114 systems, followed by Japan with 30, France with 18, and Germany with 16 systems.